kind of social issues do you work on and why do you think they're important? Uh, I feel like I'm just like a, a social justice, I don't know, warrior kind mm -hmm. of. Um, so anything that's an injustice I feel like is something that I'm passionate about speaking out on um, or taking action towards, whether that action is donating or physically being a part of a movement. So Main Idea focuses on arts accessibility and youth empowerment and the arts being visual arts, music, drama, culinary arts, you name it. Things that are going around the world about basically the Black Lives Movement and about like not many people agreeing for equality. The first thing I thought about was um, in the beginning of quarantine when all this stuff happened with like George Floyd and all that. So you see that like in one place something happened but everywhere everyone was standing up and going for it and standing up against it. So that's kind of where I thought, you know, if something bad is happening in one place, everywhere else is going to come together and kind of like try to solve it or like stand up for it. How did you get into activism? Just seeing the need and like seeing the possibilities for those needs to be met and like resources and ways that which we could do that. I feel like that's kind of what activism is. It's like seeing potential for change and like mobilizing yourself and others to go after that change and make it happen. And so right there that day, the, um, the person, the lady, she told me about the contest and I wasn't like of course for sure if I wanted to do it. But then after I tried, and I was like, why not? And then I did. I started doing um, Black History Month at my school. So I would be teaching the dance team for um, the middle schoolers. And that's when we started doing like the traditional like African dances. So we started doing that. And that's when I feel like I started getting more into like the activism stuff. My mom always exposed me to different people with different perspectives and different lifestyles. Um, so seeing injustice, um, it, was, it was hard not to. So how do you think the students who participated felt knowing that they were part of something as big as this? I definitely think they felt proud. They felt a sense of belongingness. I also think they felt like this place then becomes theirs and it's something that they can take care of and feed back into. It also gives them a safe space. What are ways, you know, your peers or people younger than you can take action in their communities? And quite honestly, youth are a force right now. Um, and I think that they're using these different, um, these different platforms to speak their mind and to be um, heard in ways that youth before you were not. So um, I, for one, think that um, they hold way more power than they think they do. That they're like humans representing something for other humans. I think a lot of times as, as a like younger person, you're often being led or told or like made to do things. Um, and we don't like, I feel like it's, youth aren't always encouraged to have their own sense of autonomy. Decisions are just kind of, you're just kind of going along with decisions that are being made. So I, I feel like the more that you're able to kind of step out of that and, and do things, make your own decisions for yourself, I feel like that's, that's going to enable you to really make change in the world. Hi. What does a mural mean to you in three words? Different quality, community, important, inspirational, colorful, caring, and justice. To, to truly be the change you wish to see in the world. As we're finishing up this mural right now, what would you say you've learned or gained from this entire experience? Be patient, how much you can get done with teamwork. Black Lives Matter. Keeping your time, not by rushing it. There's not a lot of murals like this like, around the world where I feel like there should be. The Boys and Girls is very different. Art is like a big piece to the world that it sends a good message. This mural will probably help a lot of kids here. People need to like see this and it should represent something to them. We've got some serious, seriously talented youth. 
and Worcester. Like I knew it, but seeing it in action was a whole nother level.